Hi, I'm Jana, and I'm so excited that you're here to work out with me today. Today, all you will need is a Pilates ball. We're going to do a full body workout. This is for the person who doesn't have a whole lot of time, or you know that you want to do a little bit of a workout, but you don't feel like spending a full hour to do this. So this is going to be quick, short, to the point, but going to be effective. All right, go ahead and grab your ball. You also need maybe something to hold on to, like a chair or even your countertop table. All right, starting out with our warm-up, let's go ahead and look down and up. Good, look side to side, look and look. Ear to shoulder, go side to side. All right, now we're gonna hold it. Hold it here, dropping the opposite shoulder. Good, now taking the opposite arm, take it around, all the way around, whoop, as I touch my fan and come down. Good, other ear down, drop that shoulder, breathe. Core is always nice and tight. Good. Taking the opposite arm up and around. And around. Good. Roll your shoulders back. I didn't know I was that tall. Good. Now elbows. Okay. Now big arms. Here we go. Big. Good. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Shoulders forward right here. Forward. Good. Now elbows. Okay. Big arms. If you're healing your shoulder, keep it small. Good. Give me four more. Four, three, two, and one. Take your hands, slam down your legs, turn your toes out. Good. Hang out here for a second. Good. Go ahead and drop one shoulder. Take that gaze up. Oh, I love this stretch. This is one of my very favorites. And coming back to center. And then let's switch to the same thing on the other side. And coming back to center. And then when you're ready, turn your toes forward. Arch and spine. Round it up. Good, heel toe your feet in, or you can walk your feet in. And let's go ahead and lift our knees and lift. Good, now as you're doing this, I want a straight spine, so none of this, okay? You're keeping your spine nice and straight. Good, a couple more, four, three, take your arms up over your head, hold it here. Good, now slowly begin to straighten the legs. Kick, kick. Good, now opposite arm, two leg, reach. Keeping that spine nice and straight. I don't care how high your leg goes. Give me four, three, two, and one. Go ahead and grab your Pilates ball. Mine is up here. Okay, from here, you're gonna hold it in front of you. You're gonna twist, center, twist, center. Notice that I'm pivoting my back foot, twist. And then I want you to squeeze in the center, twist, squeeze, twist, squeeze. Now add a squat right there, twist, and squat. So you have to squat and squeeze at the same time. Good. Keep going. Maybe that's what I should name this class. Squat and squeeze. <laughs> I think I'm funny. Keep going. Four, three, two, one more. Nice job. All right. I hope you feel nice and warm. We're going to go ahead and move it to the floor for some plans. As we come to the floor, take your ball. You can place it between the knees if you want to. You don't have to. All right. Coming to the floor, we're going to hold this for one minute. You're going to squeeze your um, thighs together with the ball in between if that feels good to you. All right. Are you ready? I'm going to set my timer. One minute. We got this. Ready and go. One minute. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Now, if you're working out at home and you have a dog or a kid, this is, seems to be their favorite time to attack you, right? Keep going, stop, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Breathe, lift up out of the shoulders. Stop, Luna. Keep going, squeeze, squeeze, core tight. Guess what, you're halfway there, squeeze. Stop. Keep squeezing. I want you to notice, what is that core doing? Are you pulling the belly in? Lifting up out of the shoulders. 20 seconds. Come on, you're almost there. 10. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Woo! Such a good job. Okay, from here, take your ball. You're going to place it underneath one hand. If you want, you can get rid of the ball and just do a regular plank just like we did, okay? Ball under one hand, and you're going to push down. 30 seconds, and then switch to the same thing on the other side. Ready? And go. So you're here. 
I like to take my feet out a little bit wider so that I can keep my hips nice and even. Push, push. I want you to really push down. You got this, you're almost there before we switch arms. We're not coming down as we switch. Ooh, I noticed my hips were off. We got five, four, three, two, one. Switch hands. Good job, and push, push, push. Breathe. Keep those hips even. Whew. The room is starting to get warm. You got 10 more seconds. Lift up out of that shoulder. Five, four, three, two, one. Whew, come down. Awesome job. Okay. Ugh, hair in my mouth. Okay, let's do two more planks, okay? This one, ball between the legs again. Okay, from here, all we're gonna do is we're just gonna tap both knees down and up. One minute, ready and go. Now, you know at any time, if you need to bring those knees down or want to bring those knees down and just hold it, you can do that throughout the, any of these planks, okay? Make them yours. Breathe. This is your workout. Core is tight. Keeping that gaze forward. Not up like this, but we just want that neck to be in a nice alignment from the top of our head all the way down to our heels. Guess what? You're halfway there. Come on, you can do this. Whew. After this, keep going, keep going. I'm talking to you. After this, we have a cardio plank. So I want you to decide what if if cardio is what you want today. You're gonna you're gonna do the cardio plank with me. If not, you can modify. Whew, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. And I cheated a little bit because I needed a break, so I talked to you and made you continue to go. Good job. All right, guys. We're gonna get rid of our ball for a second. We are going to do. You have four options. Take whichever option you want. Roll out those wrists a little bit as I'm talking. Okay. Our four options, mountain climbers, here, plank jacks, good, bar burpees, or you can crawl. So you come down, crawl your hands forward, hop the feet forward, two jacks back, okay? You decide what you're taking. Four options, one minute, last one. Are you ready? And go, one minute. Which option are you gonna take? Now, modify, so if you're here and you need a modifier, you can be here. If you're jacking it out, modify would be tap. If you're doing bar burpees, and you, you can just step one leg, and the other leg, and then step it back. If you're crawling down, crawl it out, walk your feet forward, and then step it back. Okay, come on. Which ooh, which option are you doing? Breathe. You got this. Guess what, you only have 20 seconds left. Switch it up if you want to. I just went from bar, from the crawl to bar burpees. You can mountain climb it. Come on, five, four, three, two, one. Whew, nice job. Okay, grab your Pilates ball. We're moving on to more core. Okay, just so you know, today's workout is not going to be heavily arm focused, but with those planks that we just did, we just, I am feeling it in my shoulders, so hopefully you are too. Right here, we're gonna take our arms out, we're gonna squeeze the ball, okay? Squeeze, squeeze. This is a little bit more of those arms, okay? Breathe. Squeeze, squeeze. I'm gonna just turn sideways so you can see, okay? Now, as you're here, ears, shoulders, hips, and knees, straight line, okay? Keep going, squeeze, squeeze. Give me eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna keep our body in a nice straight line. We're gonna lean back and come forward. Using that core, lean back and forward. Breathe. Good, you got it. Lean back and forward, back 
and four. Give me four more. Four. Three. Two. Okay, we're gonna combo both of these, okay? So we're gonna hold here. We're gonna squeeze, squeeze, four, three, two, one, lean back and forward. Squeeze, four, three, two, one, lean back and forward. Four, three, two, one, you got it. Keep going. Lean back and forward. Good, keep going. One more. We're gonna hold the lean back. Hold right here, hold right here. Core tight. Good, now pulse it up. Ooh, feel those thighs. Breathe, use your core. Good, now hold it here. We're gonna twist and center. Twist. Now, try to keep your hips even, okay? They're not moving. Twist. Twist. Breathe. Hold your twist and pulse right here. Eight. Can you go back a little farther? Yes. Switch sides and twist. Three, two, and one. Come up. Nice job. Take your ball. We're going to take it between the shoulder blades for some crunches here, okay? So come down to your mat or to the ground. I don't have a mat today. Hands behind your head. Good. And what we're going to do is we're going to crunch up and down. Breathe. What the ball does is it makes our range of motion bigger. If you want to get rid of the ball, go for it at any time. Breathe. Exhale as you come up. Good. We're going to pulse it up right here. Pulse it up. I'm trying not to breathe hard into the microphone. <laughs> Keep going. Because I'm getting sweaty. Keep going. Eight. Five, four, three, two, one. Back up and down. If you were counting, I give you an extra one there. Just so you know. I know, I know. I recognize it. Keep going. All right, guys. We're going to take one leg. We're going to pull it in. We're going to go in and then down. Now switch legs in and down. So adding that knee pull right there. Now, Notice you have to balance yourself. You have to use your core a little bit more to balance on that ball. All right. Watch the change. You're going to go in, out, in, and down. Join me on this leg. Good. Breathe. Going in, out, in, and down. In, out, in, down. Good. Keep going. In out. Exhale. Breathe. I know I keep saying breathe, but it's so important. Good. One more on the other leg. In, out, in. Now just hold it in and pulse it up. Up. Eight more. Come on. Eight. Four, three, two. Switch legs. Bring it in. Ooh, feeling it. Eight more. Come on. Eight, seven, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Okay, to end core, we're going to grab our ball. We're going to come down. Straight legs here. Balls up. Lift the head up. And we're just going to figure eight the ball between our legs. Now, modified version. Drop your heels down if you need to, okay? Enjoy me when you're ready. Come on. Switch and switch. Now, if you can, every time you switch the ball, I want you to lift a little bit higher. Good. Keep going. All right, guys. Just eight more. Come on. Eight, seven, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Stretch everything out nice and long. Ooh. Doesn't that feel so good? And when you're ready, go ahead, make your way up all the way. Grab a drink if you need to. We're moving on to some more legs. Even though we we're doing that thigh dancing, felt that for sure. Okay, grab your ball. Okay, we're staying on the ground. 
we're going to go ahead and come into that pretzel. So I want you to sit knee, ankle, straight line, knee, ankle. Take your ball and you're going to place it underneath that back ankle, okay? All right. Now I want you to try to sit up as nice and tall and straight as you can. If you need to lean a little bit more to the side, go for it. But the taller and straighter you're going to sit up, the more you're going to feel this, okay? I am kind of healing this hip today, so I might be leaning over just a little bit more on this one. From here, with the ball underneath the ankle, we're going to push down, down, down. Breathe. Good. You got it. Keep going. Push down, down. I know it feels a little awkward. If it feels awkward, you're doing it right. Good. Let's speed it up. Push down, down, down. Breathe. Push, push, push. Good. Eight more. Come on. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold here. Lift your knee up and down. Push down into that ball as you lift that knee. Lift. Lower. Lift. Good. Keep going. Good. Core tight. Pulse it up right here. Pulse it up. Up. Good, keep going. Eight. Four, three, two, hold it here. You're gonna push that leg back, pull in, back, pull in, back. Good, breathe, push it back. Now, as you push back, I want you to move this hip just slightly forward right there. Push. All right. Pulse it back right here. Pulse it back. Back. Good. Really try to push back as you push that hip forward. Keeping that knee lifted. Push. Push. Good. Keep going. Push. Good. Eight more. That's it. Eight. Four. Three. Two. One, pull it back in, hold it here, lift your knee up and up. Starting to feel it, 16 more, come on, up. Okay, last eight, here we go, eight. Four, three, two, and one, nice job. Switching to the other side, Woo. good job. Place that ball underneath the ankle. Make sure that knee and that ankle, or that knee and that hip, are in a straight line. Here we go. Pushing down and down. Core tight. Breathe. Good. Keep going. Good. Now speed it up. Push, push, push. Good. You can do it. Push. I know. Like I said on the other side. If it feels awkward, you're doing it right. Push, push. Try to control it as much as you can, even though it feels a little out of control. Good. Give me eight, seven, four, three. Lift your knee. Here we go. Lift and lower. Keep going. Lift and lower. If you need to adjust that ball, go for it. Lift. Oh, yeah. I'm feeling it. Lift. Now, try to take out the weight in your hand. I just noticed I was really kind of starting to lean to the side. Try to make sure that you're sitting nice and tall and straight. You're filling in the glute, in that hip flexor maybe. Lift. All right. Pulse it up right here. Pulse it up. Good. Keep going. Okay. Eight more. You got it. Eight. Four. Three. Two. Push it back. Push it back and forward. Really push back. As you do so, the hip comes forward. Push. Good. Keep pushing. If you need to just that ball, go for it. Push and forward. All right, push it, pulse it back, back. Oh, yeah, come on, push. Keep going back and back, pushing that hip forward just slightly. If you're doing the workout, this might as well get the most out of it, right? 
So continue to push forward. So we're filling up more in that glute. You got it. Breathe. Eight more. Push eight. Four, three, two, and one. Good. Come forward. Lift your knee up and lower. Up and lower. Keep going. Good. Pulse it up. Here we go. Up, up. Sitting up nice and tall and straight. I know, I know. Keep going. We're all in this together. Breathe. Good. Relax your shoulders. You got it. Give me eight more. That's it. Eight, seven, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Oh, there goes my ball. Good job. All right. Just bring those legs forward for a second. Inhale, reach those arms up. And then you're going to hinge forward, grab those feet. We're not done quite yet. We're going to stand up and just do a little bit more legs, okay? When you're ready, come up, grab your ball. Okay, put that ball underneath your one heel. I don't care if you start with your right or left, okay? It's just going to be under your heel so that you're kind of stepping on it. All right, wow, I need to, I need to blow this ball up a little bit more. All right, from here, we're going to step the other leg back. You're going to step back and forward, back. Now, as you come forward, you can go flat foot or you can come up to your, your tippy toe. I don't care whichever one feels okay for you. Breathe, Woo, find that balance, breathe. Good, keep going, ooh, I got an itch on my back. Don't you hate that when you get an itch, especially in a place where you can't itch very easily? Breathe, good, keep going, four, three, two, we're gonna hold it back. Hold it here. Push your heel down, down, down. Oh, yeah. Come on. Can you get a little lower for me? Come on. Push, push. Eight more. Eight, seven, four, three. Hold here. Pulse your body down and down. Woo. Feeling it right there. Give me 16, come on, down. Last eight, eight. Four, three, two, and one. Whew. Switching legs. We're not wasting any time because it's a short workout today. All right, take the other leg back. Make sure you set up before you start stepping back. Breathe through it. Ooh, I'm already feeling it in this leg. All right, guys. Four more. Four. Two. Hold it back. Hold it here. Now push your heel down, down. Ooh, I'm feeling that shake. Yes. Ears, shoulders, hips, straight line. Find that balance. This is where if you want to hold on to a chair or something else, go for it. Whew, come on, you got it. Good. Eight more. Eight. Four. Three. Hold right here. Pulse it down. 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 Okay. If you're not feeling it yet, can you get a little lower? Yes, you can. Come on. Down. All right, the countdown, eight more, come on, eight. Four, three, two, and one. Oh, I got that shake going on, woo. Guess what? You did it, I'm so proud of you. Let's stretch quickly. We're not gonna spend a lot of time on stretching, so if you need a longer stretch, go for it, okay? Inhale, your arms up, and exhale, you're gonna bring your hands to your knees, arch the spine, round it up. Good, inhale, reach your arms up, exhale, arch down. You know what, I am so proud of you because you could have very easily just been like, I don't have enough time today, I'm not doing anything, but you did it, and I'm so proud of you. And I'm so happy that you let me work out with you today. I'm sweating hard, I'm breathing hard. Hold here, good, hands can come down to the ground. If you want, straight spine, breathe. One hand comes directly in the center of your body, up or down, and then reach the other arm up towards the ceiling. Release. Same thing, other side. 
and release. Turn your toes out, knees come down, hands come on your um, thighs here, or you can bring your elbows down, it's up to you. Just hanging out here for a second. Oh, doesn't that feel so good? Good job, and turn your toes back forward, hands come down to the ground or to your shins. Heel toe the feet in close together. I'm gonna turn this way so you can see. Breathe if you want, reach for the opposite elbow. Hands, or walk, rock side to side. And then when you're ready, bend the knees, round the spine, feel each vertebrae as you come all the way up. And exhale as you bring the arms down. Such a great job, you guys, I'm so proud of you. Let's go ahead and do our bow, take a step out to the side. A nice little bow, and same thing on the other side. Thanks, you guys. I'll see you next time.